and give it to Deepak. Even though I added tiles, even though I added catalog group, Deepak cannot see anything. User cannot see anything. So we have to also go back to everyone. And this is a default role. You can create your own role. Let's say, let me create a role also. So I create a role. And in this custom role, I can just name it as custom role. I can just give a role ID, switch on and save. So now what I did is I've created a custom role in the site manager in my build work zone. So whosoever have the role, they will get the access of these applications. Yeah. So I myself don't have this role right now assigned to me. So I cannot access these apps. So let's go as a business user. Our business user Deepak don't have the role. So what I will do now, I will grant this role to Deepak, our business user. So he can see these applications. Yeah. So let's do that. Where do you do that? You go back to here. Yeah. And here is your user. Now you have to take this email ID of the user. Copy that from the SAP Cloud Identity Service. And then you need to come back to the BTP account. Your BTP account cockpit. Go to your sub account. Go to users tab. Create a user here with the email ID. And then your identity provider will be this the SAP Cloud Identity Service. Click on create. Email already exists. Okay, good. It's already there. So I think it should be visible here. I think here it is. You see, it's visible already to me in the user section. It's already visible. Good. Yeah. So there was a question, Anubhav, will that user which you register, will it automatically appear under user tab? Yes, you see, automatically appear. So now I will grant this user role. What was my role name? Custom role. You see the custom role which we created? I grant it. I grant it. I click on assign. So now I've granted Deepak that custom role which we created in build work zone. So when Deepak goes back and refresh, he's got a role. He should be able to see the tile, but right now not. He has to log out and log in because his cookie is the problem of cookie. Cookie is not refreshed. So his cookie needs to refresh. He has to log in again. So I log out as Deepak and I log in again. I've granted him the role. I log in as a business user and now let's see he still not see the applications why so I'll go back to the site directory this is our site click on the setting icon it opens the site settings go to the role assignment and we have to tell the computer that the custom role which we created belongs to this site so click on edit button and you see the custom role which you created just switch it on assign to the site so that computer will know that okay there is a role role is associated to the site and on this site is where it has to show these applications so click on okay now done and when you come back as a business user deepak and refresh wahala your fury applications are now well integrated and gelled up when you click launch products you see your html5 repository application yes which we created end to end the serverless fury app fully working amazing thank you once again for your time i'll see you in the next class till then happy building happy coding and goodbye